Hello and welcome to Dulwich Hamlet Radio on Mixler. Winter is definitely here as the fog descends on a chilly Champion Hill for the return of London Senior Cup action. Ryan Matthews here to be joined by two very special guest co-commentators throughout the match between Dulwich Hamlet and Cray Wanderers. This is a match that's rich with subplots, with the visit of Cray bringing the return of one of Champion Hill's favourite sons, Nyren Clunas, the King of Camberwell, for his first match against DHFC since leaving. Other former Hamlet players are also among Smith's men, including Anthony Cook and David Ajaha. Clark to take this one again, calmly offering him the short option, but that one's refused. And he swings it in right-footed instead. Head in the centre circle, oh. just wide. So unlucky. Won really well by Kresnik Kresnicki oh. there. 25, approaching 30 nearly. Would the more likely, the left-footer, though Wusu is lining this one up instead, stamps it. In towards oh, the near a post. It's got to be a penalty. penalty. Surely and oh. struck into the back of the net. Advantage played. <laughs> and that's 1-0. Uh, what, what a bizarre time well, to play that was. We'll take the lead. <laughs> exactly. What, a, what an odd little piece of play that was. So the free kick was struck beautifully by Nana Rawusu. Smashed at uh, Sean Rowley, who, to be honest, made an absolute mess of it at his near post. Punched it out into the danger area. Krasnicki was pulled down as he looked to slot that one away. Referee gave nothing and Jaden Clark reacted quick to this, smashing it into the bottom corner, meaning that it's Dulwich Hamlet 1, Cray Wanderers 0. Yeah. Launches it long. Awek is underneath that and launches the header forwards and Nanzala is chasing this one. Yeah. Nanzala gets in there and is pushed down. Referee uh, had a good look at that, but uh, nothing doing. And tackle. a wonderful tackle back there by George Porter and it's played out towards the right hand side for Owusu, the Hamlet keeping the pressure on here they've got a few in the box, played low, oh, drops finish. and struck, lovely strike that's two Jayden for Jaden Clark. Clark just doing what Jaden Clark does <laughs> it's a lovely the his Hamlet ears must have been burning, we've just been talking about him, exactly, there was pressure from that right hand side, good tackle back from George Porter and released Nana Owusu on the right hand side who accelerated fizzed the ball across the six yard box and who was there as the ball deflected out to him, but Jaden Clark again stepping onto it to put the ball in exactly the same place. Bottom corner, 2-0. Yeah, exactly the same, isn't it? Great, another great finish, tucked it away and nicely. <laughs> pretty nasty way a couple of times so far. <laughs> Game is back underway. It's Comley looking for Nzala, and he's found the space on this left-hand side, Ash Nzala. Gets the early crossing from the left-hand side, finds Porter, nods oh, into the six-yard box. Unlucky. Clark was lurking there. Set him up for his attribute. He there. could sniff that one, couldn't they? The equality, diversity, and inclusion work, and you know those conversations sort of manifested into you know the mask in myself. And yeah, it's been really good. I've been really enjoying doing the work. You know, it's what I do for my day job, so it's um, it's something that, that I'm really enjoying. Great ball in and a really great finish. Good goal. What a lovely goal that is. Really good goal by Dalic Hamlet. Great work down the right hand side between Krasnicki and Sanchez Ming. Ming put it absolutely on a dime there for a for Amari Hibbert, the substitute to side foot into the top corner. Lovely yeah. goal. Yeah, lovely goal. Great movement from, from Sanchez. Great movement from Amari getting across his man. And uh, yeah, great finish. And I think that should hopefully put the game to bed. And with that, on the hour mark comes another substitution. And it's going to be uh, Sanchez Ming's last act of this game. It's going to come off and be replaced by Josh Hill. It looks like Joel Powell's going to come on for this last half hour as well. We're all friends, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> we, all, we all know each other. <laughs> Called them the Chiselhurst set earlier on. Yeah. Ronnie Vince seemed to enjoy that. They certainly are. <laughs> <laughs> it's Hill slotting into the centre of that back four. Losing the ball down the left-hand side. A sliding challenge by Hill. He's given away the penalty. Oh, Josh. That's mm -hmm. it. And it's Yahaya Bamba, the number 12. Up against Aaron Jones. Bam steps forward. Strikes into that bottom corner. Jones will be unhappy with that. He got close, dived the right way, but it was tucked right into that bottom corner. Good penalty. Looking yeah. To, looking to kick long down this right-hand side. Headed high up into the air by Cray Wanderers. Brought down well by Krasnicki and finds Joel Powell in the centre of the park. Good movement by Powell. Gives it to Porter. Porter dribbles past the referee. Tries to play it out to the left-hand side. Second half asking, he finds Nzala. Nzala with a strike. Drops to Porter. Porter's lovely job. What a finish. What a Great goal. Great finish. I mean, Great I, finish. I called him the Chiselhurst Slatten earlier on, and he's just done it again. That's a stunner. That's one for the highlights. Really good finish from Porter. Well, that's, that's what he does, man. He's a fox in the box. 
pings up into the air. He controls it with the outside of his outside of his heel, swivels and launches it into that top corner. Yeah, great finish from Port. So that'll give him some confidence. Great response from the Hamlet after conceding that penalty. It's now Dulwich Hamlet four, Cray Wanderers one. And a chance to break for Cray. That's a lovely outside the right foot pass. What Good a tackle that is. Sliding challenge there from there. Uh, what a tackle that is, Quaid. Quaid Taylor. And then Wood plays the through ball, looking for Anzala on that left wing. Cray is stretched here. It's Anzala trying Come to on. measure his cross. In product, in product. Looks for Felix at the top of the box. Left foot. Felix Good. with a left footed strike oh. off the bar. There is nothing he can't do. Goes down the line. Looking for Wood, but it's just loose and intercepted by Cray. But Krasnicki wins the ball back. And uh, instead of trying to pay the pass, Ooh. he tries to win a throw in. And now it's a chance in the box for Clunis. That was Cookie. <laughs> Cookie's oh, got to use the word man. passionate players within, yeah. within our dressing room. And I think that sometimes it can be to the detriment of, of the team. Spilled by Jones. Goes out for a corner. Yeah, I think it's just about players out there. You know, it's really good. Get, get some minutes in their legs. Um, and yeah, you know, we want to make winning a habit. So whatever competition we're in, we want to we want to make sure that we're winning it, and it will give us confidence going into the game Saturday. Oh, it's a difficult game to go. Oh, lovely chip. That's a great. And finish. It's a great finish. That's a great finish. It's a consolation, but it's a fantastic finish. Jones caught out there, chasing after a ball. It's a free kick about ten yards inside the Dulwich Hamlet half on the in the centre left channel. It's the goal scorer Sam Wood lining this one up. Clips it towards the far post. Keepers up. Oh my God. Breaks, Jones pounces on it at his near post. Well done, Aaron Jones. How long are we playing, Riff? I mean, that's been at least seven, I would think. It so definitely is now. World Cup minutes now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a little bit nervy at the end now. Just a touch. Yeah, didn't need to be like this. Jones there lines it up there and launches long, and that is the end of what has ended up being a very exciting game.